Hi, this is Helena Hart from CommitmentConnection.com, and in this video, I wanted to answer a question I received from a woman in our community who asks if she stops chasing the man that she's been dating, will he notice and will it work to re-attract him and bring him closer since he's been acting distant and pulling away? This is such a fantastic question. I know I get versions of this question all the time from women, so hopefully this will be really helpful for you. But for First, if you're looking to attract the man you want and bring him closer than ever, or if you're with a man and you want to deepen the connection and strengthen your relationship, be sure to click the button to subscribe to our YouTube channel to stay up to date on all of our latest videos and information. So if she stops chasing this man, will he notice and will it work to re-attract him? The short answer to this question is yes, in my opinion. If he is the right man for you and he's really interested in you and he wants to pursue you, if he's a masculine energy man who enjoys pursuing the woman that he's interested in, absolutely, if you stop chasing him, Typically, he will notice and he will start coming back towards you, depending on how long you've been seeing each other and some other factors. So this really all goes back to masculine and feminine energy, like so many of the principles I teach. So I'm sure you're familiar with masculine and feminine energy, but in case you're not, really quick, masculine energy is the part of us that's about doing things and solving problems and planning and making decisions. Anything that looks like leaning forward or trying to figure something out or get something done. And feminine energy is the opposite. It's the part of us that's really about being in the moment, feeling, experiencing, receiving, and expressing. Also trusting and allowing and responding are also very feminine energy qualities. So anything that looks like leaning back and just experiencing the moment rather than trying to make something happen constantly with a man or in a relationship. So we all have both masculine and feminine energy. Men and, and women have both. And they both play a really important role in our lives. The problem happens is you know when we take all of that masculine energy we have and rather than using it in work, or in other areas of our life, we turn it on to a man. Oh, and this is Leo. <laughs> Leo's been sleeping next to me while I've been making videos today, and he just woke up, so he's helping me out. Um, so typically, you know, when, when a man starts acting distant or pulling away and we're really interested in him, we will start uh, chasing inadvertently, even on accident. You know, we can accidentally push men away like that. We will start, you know, calling him more or texting him or setting up plans. It's like we don't want him to slip through our fingers, right? That's why at auctions, you know, people end up with all kinds of things they don't really want. It's that instinct in us as humans to not want something to slip through our fingers. So typically if a man starts pulling away, it's just the natural energy exchange. We start chasing him down, even in very subtle ways, like trying to convince him that he should take us out this weekend or trying to show him of what a great woman we are, what a great relationship partner we would be. And all of these things just push him further and further away, especially if he's a masculine energy man, because it takes us out of our feminine energy, which is where all our power is when it comes to attracting a man and really inspiring him to pursue us and, and lock us down for a real committed relationship. So if we start chasing a guy, he can't help it. He has to back up and take some space for himself, typically. So if you stop doing all of those things that push a man away, one of two things will happen. Either, you know, if he's not interested, if he's really not the right man for you or not serious about, you know, pursuing you for a real relationship, he will probably just back off and fizzle out. And that's a great thing, in my opinion, because it's just he's making room or creating the space for an even better man for you to step in and really step up and pursue you the way you want to be pursued and deserve to be, right? Um, that, that may happen if he's not interested. The second thing that might happen if he is truly into you and he wants a relationship with you, he will absolutely come back towards you on his own. It might take a little while, depending on how long you've been chasing him, how long you've been leaning forward or maybe pushing him away. Sometimes it takes men a little while to sort of recalibrate and get used to the 
old relationship dynamic. But in general, I will say men can recover quickly and relationships can recover quickly. If he's truly right for you and he really wants to be with you, absolutely. If you stop chasing him and just watch what happens, sort of watch what he does a little more dispassionately, he's going to start to feel safe to come close and come back towards you all on his own without any sort of prompting or pushing or pursuing on your end. So that's what I have for today. I would love to hear how this goes for you. Um, just to recap, in general, if you stop chasing a man, one of two things will happen. Either he will just fizzle out and fade away because he wasn't interested or he's not a masculine energy man who's really capable of stepping up and doing relationship. Or if he is interested, if he does really believe that you could be the right woman for him, he will typically come back towards you. You'll notice him getting in contact with you more often. He may ask to see you and things should typically shift right back to the way they were before you started chasing him or leaning forward or pushing him away. So I hope that answered your question. I would love to hear your thoughts and experiences with this. Feel free to type those into the comment section and I will see you next time. Thanks for watching, and if you'd like to discover exactly what to say and do to get the man and relationship you've always wanted, click the button on the right side of this video to visit our website, and I will talk to you soon.